personal fit, welcome to Lunch Crunch. We're gonna tackle the core, a lot of different body positions. We have five exercises, we'll run through two sets. I'll do this with you in real time, it'll be easy to follow. Guys, all you need is an optional, really, ab map. Okay, so guys, let's go through this. Um, we're gonna start with a leg lift twist. I'll put the circuit up here so you can kind of see the whole circuit. And um, guys, with this, we're going about, I'd say about 10 each way here, okay? And what we're gonna do is we're going to do a leg lift, hands just down to the side, we're gonna do a leg lift, and at the top, we're just gonna twist, and then come back down, in a little twist. So, kind of like corkscrew here, but really getting those obliques, and lower abs, too. We're gonna get 10 in each direction, and I'm trying to lead with the heels here, guys. And you can really feel that. So when you come up, just try to lift hips and twist, and you really feel those lower obliques just really tie in. Try not to come over the head. I got one more here. I think I went over 10. All right, as we bring those legs down, next exercise, and guys, you should really be able to feel that. Uh, we're gonna go to a low side plank. We do these occasionally, and there's several different exercises you can do from the low plank. We're gonna do a dip, and then we're gonna do a reach. We're gonna reach under the body and reach up, okay? Um, if you have a hard time with these, as you could just go from the knees, okay? dip down. So this is kind of like a beginner. I'd like you to try to get to the point where you have your feet straight and you can stack your feet or stack them. Okay? I think I'm going to stack them here. Guys, make sure your support arm is straight on the shoulder. We don't want it out in front where you're kind of dipping down or even too close in where you're kind of stressing that. So good support. We're up here to feel this on the side facing the floor. So I'm up here, guys. Hand up and I'm going to Dip and reach. One, two, three, four. So it's really feel, I like that a lot. You're kind of moving your body around a little bit, nice dynamic. We're gonna match reps with the other side. So we're here. Stuff. I like them. Guys, we're doing frog crunch next. So, taking the hip flexors out of the crunch and just a little different um, dynamic here. We're going to put your feet together. We're going to lay back. I'm pushing my feet together in. So, kind of froggy looking here. Hands are behind your head. 
and I'm just gonna crunch up, I'm gonna hold for a second and come back down. 15 to 20 of these, okay? So, and uh, so we're gonna hold for one or two count at the top. Exhale as you come up. Guys, I'll be five more here. All right, guys, we'll come down. Okay, next exercise, guys alternating flutter kicks. Okay. And we're going to do a little, I'm going to do a little hip thrust with this one. So, you know, my arms down on the side, guys. Legs are up. We're gonna come down. Up, get a little hip thrust there. One. Two. So we switch to the top. Really contract as the leg comes up. Three. Ten to fifteen. There's four with each leg. behind your head as well. Roll the shoulders up tightly, slightly. Boy, you have a burn. It's, it's good. I was shifting you, so it's like little 30, almost like 30 reverse crunches, really. When you do that little hip lift, in essence, you're doing reverse crunch, and boy, they, they'll really get you. All right, guys, uh, we're going to do a, a cross-body knee drive and slide, okay? So, some knee slides. Basically, we're going to get in an up plank here, and I don't really need this mat. Let's get it out of the way. So, uh, guys, we're going to get in an up plank position. We're only going to do 10 each way here, okay? I think these will challenge you a little bit. Um, and we're kind of like doing a cross plank. We're going to drive the knee across the body and then slide up the arm. Um, guys, I'm not as flexible as I used to be. If you can come all the way to the forearm, that's great. Or just go as far as you can and lift up. Okay, so let's go through these, all right? I'll do them with you here, of course. So we're here, guys. Cross body knee drive. Lift. We're going to slide. So the whole body kind of dries up and you can really feel these. And they look much easier than they are. Challenge you. I'll do one more. Oh, very challenging. Wow, like those. Those are good. It's one of those exercises that they're much more difficult than they look. So I'm gonna lay back down here, guys, and we're gonna start round two. Minimal rest, guys. Leg lift. Twist. So, can you 
arms out your side if you want to here. Similar to a corkscrew here, guys. I'm just gonna try to lead with the heels. I'm gonna come up and twist. One. Two. Don't have to go too low. Right about here. Just trying to twist the hip as I come up right there. Twist my feet. Really feel them. Nine. Second rounds will be tough. Okay, I'll bring them down. Guys, great job. Really feeling those lower abs and tightening those obliques a little with that twist. Great, great exercise. Okay, we have our low side plank, dip and reach. All right, so guys. 10 to 15 of these. All right, here we go. So we're up, we're gonna dip. One, two, two, three. Oh, great, great exercise. We'll switch sides. Take a breath. Whew. And here we go. Really reach under your body. You really feel them. Guys, we're going to our crunch. Okay, so feet get into the frog, press their feet together, and we're gonna do like a two pound hold. All right, so 15 to 20 of these. We go. Really feeling those, you know, especially of course that that upper upper band. Oh, okay. So next exercise, guys. We have got alternating flutter kicks, and if you can get that little hip lift, 
wow, is that gonna light you up? So work on that. If that's a challenge for you, try to get as many as you can. If you have a difficult time, just try to work toward that, all right? So guys, we're gonna go 10 to 15 each leg. You, you can't put your arms out. I don't put my hands behind the head to just further engage that core, okay? So here, start with the legs up, and I'm gonna come down. Right here, guys, right here, I do a little hip lift. As each leg comes up, hip lift. Two. They are burning. Oh. Guys, that was 15 with each leg. And we have a good one coming up. A cross body, knee drive and slide. Here we go. Get up. This, we'll slide this out over here. Okay, guys. Remember for our first set, up plank, knee across the body, and just lift. All right. Amazing how effective these are. Man. All right. So we're here. Cross up. Lift. Guys, that was our core condition workout for today. Five exercises, two sets, and it should get you fatigued. It really helped strengthen that midsection. Hope you enjoyed the routine. Thanks for joining me. This is Elite Fitness, bringing wellness to you.